you told a story on Twitter mm -hmm. um, about this time that Derek Jeter took your girl. He and did. It, and it went viral. It we went did viral. a segment on it. We did a segment did a on segment. it back when it was called Numbers you Never Lie. You took my pain and, uh, for, for viewership. We did. I mean, we exploited you. Yes. So let's exploit you some more. Okay. And have you tell everyone what happened with you and Derek Jeter. <sighs> Long story short, I uh, just got out of college, worked a corporate job uh, in a corporate car. And this is during the MySpace days. Ooh. So uh, it was a woman who uh, we never met. This is before catfish and all that stuff. And uh, I put her in my top uh, eight. That was, oh, that was big. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was, that was big. big. And yeah. uh, I kept moving her up. And then uh, she said, come to New York. And I was from Cleveland, never been to New York before. So I took my, my Ford Taurus uh, late model car and uh, drove to New York. And this is before, this is, you know, uh, uh, early 2000s. So appetizers weren't big. So I treated her appetizer, dessert, got the hotel room. Yeah. It, was, it, was, it was major. And uh, my dad has a quote, if you have a good night, end it. And no, I said, let's go to the lounge or club. And, you know, I'm on a fixed income. I don't have that much money. And we go to this place. This is before bottle service and stuff. And uh, we go in, and uh, I, I've got a bottle of champagne. And uh, the, the young lady didn't know who Derek Jeter was. So I'm pumping up, that's Derek Jeter, the whole team. Remember, and this is like old Derek Jeter when he has hair, and he's looking good, the captain, and, and all this other stuff. And, and uh, his heyday. Yeah, and his heyday. And I'm okay. telling, him, telling her all about him. I go to the restroom, come back, and uh, they're talking. I'm like, that's, that's so cool. Rap. Like, we can get, and this is a flip phone. So I'm thinking maybe we can get, you know, a picture or something. And, uh, uh, yeah. And then uh, he left with her. Yeah. And, uh, kinda he left with the girl. He left with her. And then what, what happened was, <laughs> she, we were supposed to split the bottle. And so I only had my half, so my car was declined, <laughs> which actually made my hotel room I got mess up. So I went from, and she was also my ride, because I left my car at the hotel. And I've never been to New York. You, it's okay. It's so Derek Jeter left you girlless, broke, carless, and yeah. hopeless. And the worst part of it was, I was such a fan, like I would have went with them. <laughs> like I was like, I want to I wanna know where Derek Jeter lives. Yeah, I'm like, I'll be in the guest room. I like baseball. She don't even like baseball. Why is she even here? I want to go. And uh, I ended up having that crash, like a, a great aunt's house who, you know, smelled like ointment. And uh, it was just bad. And I was there two more days. Had no money. And uh, I literally, I, I took a cab and I had to tell the guy up front I had money. And I'm from Cleveland. I didn't know that was a bad thing. So he puts me out the cab. Had to figure out a bus and all that stuff. But Derek Jeter, yeah, if you out there, where's the camera? If you out there, that wasn't nice.